As a lot of you may know, fishing is probably the most controversial aspect of Stardew Valley. There's a lot of people who love fishing, there's a lot of people who hate fishing, and more than anything else, pretty much everybody across the board can agree that fishing is really hard. And this has created a lot of discourse uh, about what is the hardest fish to catch. Some people say it's the octopus. Some people say it's the legend. Some people say it's the lava eel. So today, I wanted to put to bed these rumors and give us the definitive list on all things fish in a fish tier list. Now, we'll be ranking these fish on both two aspects, right? The first aspect is how hard the fish is to catch once you've got it on the line. The second aspect we'll be judging on is how hard this fish is to find. So maybe you have to go to an obscure location. Maybe its bite rate is really low. Maybe it only comes out on certain days. Maybe it only comes out at night, okay? So first off, we got the albacore. So I feel like an albacore isn't like easy, right? They're not like something that you're gonna be like fishing up like every single time, but they get fished up like pretty decently and they're available in most seasons. Anchovy might be like the easiest fish in the game. Anchovy is super easy. They're available, I think, in all seasons in the ocean. Probably one of the easier fishes in the game. Never even worth your trouble either. Like they just sort of like get in the way of all of the like fish that you actually want to catch. Killer fish definitely is also an easy. Now, despite being a legendary fish, the angler fish like might be one of the easiest fish in the game. I think you only have to be like level four to catch the angler fish. Level three, even lower than I thought, which you can literally do with like, you can do with like a single seafoam pudding You at level zero, right? Like the angler fish is one of the easiest fish to catch in the game. It doesn't really have a hard pattern or anything. The only like catch I guess you would say is that you have to stand in a specific spot, but very easy. So now for the blobfish, I'm between hard and annoying for this one, right? Because it's not super hard once you get it on the line, right? But it is really annoying to find. But like, it's so annoying that it might even be hard because the blobfish is only available at the night market, which is like super annoying and like out of the way. But I didn't remember having much trouble catching the blobfish. It probably took me like a couple attempts, but I'll put it in annoying. Now you also need to consider the season they're caught in, right? Like a hard fish in winter is easier than the same level of hardness in spring. Does that make sense? Because in your normal playthrough, like, you'll be encountering it first in spring. Which I guess isn't technically fair, but like, hey, that's just the way it goes. Blue Discus is very easy. You catch it on Ginger Island, like, very frequently. Never had a problem with it. One of the easiest fish to catch in the game. Alright, Bream. Bream is pretty easy. Bream is a little annoying because you can only catch it at night. But you can catch it, like, for a lot of the night. It's like 6pm and I think you can catch it in every single season. It's the easiest of the night fishing bundle fish to catch by a long shot. Very, very easy to catch the Bream. Once you get it on the line, it probably has like the same level of difficulty as like a bullhead or something. Bullheads? Bullhead is like easy, yeah. Bullheads are also great because they're very profitable, but nothing too particularly hard about a bullhead, you know? Like you just fish it up and then that's pretty much the end of it. Okay, carp is like probably the easiest fish to catch in the game besides the sunfish, so not even a question. Catfish is definitely annoying. Catfish are only available when it rains. And I don't know, some people are really good at catching the catfish. I am not. When it rains on like spring three of year one, everyone's like, oh, just go catch catfish in the, in the, in the forest river. I can't. I don't know how. I'm not very good at it. It has like a weird pattern that I haven't mastered. Catfish are super annoying to catch. Chub is a joke, easy. This is the crimson. Crimson fish. Now the crimson fish I've actually found to be probably one of the more annoying legendaries. For some reason I can never hook it. Even at like level 10 at like optimal conditions, for some reason I always have trouble hooking the crimson fish. So I'm definitely gonna put it in hard. I don't know if that's just me and maybe I just have like bad luck. Like a lot of people like talk about all the legendary other legendary fish, but I feel like the crimson fish is the one that's the least talked about. The Dorado. For some reason I never catch Dorados. Dorado was the last fish I needed to catch for when I caught all the fish for my perfection file. And I honestly don't know why. It looks like it's relatively easy to catch. I guess it's because I don't usually like, do much fishing in summer. I don't know. I honestly thought this was like a, a like a, a rare drop or something when I was looking at it. It's definitely the top of annoying. The only reason it's not higher is because like the proof is like right there that it's not that hard to catch. But like, I don't know. I had a hard time catching it. It feels rarer than it actually is. Maybe that's my own personal bias, but hey. This is my dang tier list. Okay, the eel is definitely in hard. Eels can be really hard, especially if you encounter one in spring. They have like a really funky pattern. They're like the worst version of the 
the catfish. And I think you can only catch them at night when it's raining, which is like super annoying. And I feel like I always have a hard time like catching one or like reeling one up, I guess, or getting one to bite. What's this thing? The flounder? Easy. Flounder is a joke. Now the ghost fish is definitely an annoying because to catch it, you need to go to level 40 of the mines. It's always really annoying to catch stuff in there. Like any of the mines pools are like really annoying to catch because you fish up so much trash. Okay, the glacier fish. For some reason, a lot of people have told me that they have trouble catching the glacier fish, but I've never really had that problem. I've never really experienced it. I, I always consider it one of the easier legendary fish to catch. And maybe this is just anecdotal evidence, but that's kind of what this entire list is, so. What level do you need to be? Level six, yeah. I've never really had much trouble with this thing. Maybe it's just because I'm usually a higher fishing level by winter, and I'm like always looking for things to do in winter because there's not as much to do, so I always like, I'm like, oh, I might as well just go and get the glacier fish, but I don't really have a lot of trouble with it. Its pattern never seems pretty particularly difficult to me. Halibut's easy. What is this thing? I don't remember what fish that is. I was doing pretty well up until now. Herring. Oh, herring is easy. Now the ice pip. I didn't even catch the ice pip. This was the other fish I didn't catch. Mines level 60. Ugh. Yeah, this thing is definitely hard. Not only do you have to catch in this stupid mines pond that takes forever, it also just, I remember it being like, somewhat difficult to catch and like I cooked up a bunch of other stuff and I don't know it took me forever to catch it I think also because I like forgot that it existed like mo yeah see like what even I don't even remember the ice pit largemouth bass is very easy very very easy all right now the lava eel I feel like most people might I don't know I think this might be controversial honestly but I think the lava eel is the hardest fish in the game to catch by a lot it has like so many of the aspects of things that I found annoying so far. Like you have to go down to the mines. It's easy to forget about and it's difficult to get on the line. And once you actually get it on the line, oh my God, this thing is impossible to catch. I remember like going by like a bunch of lava eels before actually catching one. And the worst part is if you, if you fail catching it, then you have to wait like another eternity to fish one up and you're fishing up so much trash. It took me like days in the game to catch this thing oh my god i had so much trouble with the lava eel and maybe this is commonplace but like by far way harder for time than any other fish in the game oh my god i hate the lava eel i hate this thing so much man oh my god if i would n i never want to have to catch a stupid lava eel again all right the legend is hard legend is hard but not too hard it's annoying because you have to go on a rainy day in spring but you'll you definitely have to wait until spring uh, year two, because there's no way you're getting, uh, level 10 fishing. But since you have level 10 fishing, you probably have access to, like, whatever it's called, the Iridium Rod and a bunch of, like, tackles. So you have, like, a lot of buffs that'll make the legend a lot easier, I think. Still don't think it's the hardest legendary fish. I still think that I've had the most trouble with the Crimson Fish. All right, what the heck is this thing? The Ling Cod. Uh, I don't remember this thing. I'm just gonna put in easy. I never remember having trouble with this thing at all. Uh, okay. What is this, the Tiger Trout? No, 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 no. It's not the Tiger Trout. It's the, what is this thing called? The Lion Fish. Lion Fish feels like very easy. I don't remember ever having trouble catching this thing. All right, Midnight Carp is really annoying. It's so annoying that it might even be hard. We have to catch a bunch of these things for like a bunch of different reasons. And they're so annoying to catch. You catch them like late at night. Don't you have to catch this thing at the night market? Oh no, you catch it at a bunch of different places. I don't remember why I thought this thing was hard, but oh, that's why. Cause you can only catch it from 10 PM to 2 AM. That's really annoying. That might even be hard. All right, this is the midnight squid. What the heck is it called? Oh, it is called the midnight squid. Oh, wow. Now the midnight squid kind of gets off like a little easier because like you're trying to fish up your blobfish so hard that you'll fish up your midnight squid beforehand. You know what I mean? Midnight squid is like at the bottom of annoying for me. You know when I go to a blobfish like up here. All right, the mutant carp I've always, always, always found to be the easiest legendary fish. Well, I guess except the angler fish. The angler fish is probably easier in their mind. Uh, I'll put it at the top of easy. I've never had trouble with this thing. It's super easy to find because you just go down the sewers and it's like one of the only two fish that you'll catch. You don't fish up much like trash there because the pond is pretty big. I've never really had trouble with the mutant carp at all. It's not the easiest legendary fish, but it's pretty close. Now the octopus. The octopus, I think I also sort of have a controversial opinion on and it's that that it's not that, 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 
hard. Like, I will still probably put it in impossible, but like, it's not as hard as everybody makes it out to seem. At least when I caught my octopus, I didn't find it too, too difficult. It was more just annoying to get it on the line. But once I actually got it on the line, I think I caught it on my like first attempt or something like that. Like, it's still hard, but everybody makes it out to seem like octopus is the hardest fish in the game when it's leagues easier than the lava eel. At least that was my experience. What time do you catch the octopus at? 6 a.m. to 1 p.m. Oh, that is pretty early to make it over all the way over to the ocean. Yeah, it's pretty hard, but it's not as hard as everybody makes it out to seem. All right, perch, easy. Pike is also easy. I've never had trouble with the pike. Pufferfish is like the definition of an annoying fish, right? Like you can pretty consistently catch a pufferfish above level like five, but besides that, it's like pretty annoying to catch up. I generally don't have too much trouble with it. Rainbow trout, I honestly find annoying to catch. I did not, maybe it's just me, but I always had trouble catching this thing. I feel like it never bites. And I remember getting it on a line and, uh, and it honestly put up a bit of a struggle. All right, what is this thing? The red something, red mullet. Red mullet is very easy. I don't remember ever having trouble with this thing. Same with the red snapper, very easy. Salmon is easy. Mm, sandfish is annoying, I think. Sandfish is just annoying, man, to reel up. You gotta go all the way to the desert. Once you go to the desert, it's like pretty much the only thing you can catch, but it does still take a while to fish up. So it is pretty annoying in that aspect, but it's not like the bottom of annoying. The annoying part is getting the desert unlocked, I guess. Sardine, very easy. This thing, what is this thing called? The scorpion carp, also available in the desert. Where I remember I hate, absolutely hating this thing. Oh, only available at the desert in level four. I, I remember it being a real struggle to hook this thing up. Like I was catching a bunch of sandfish and getting the scorpion carp was like, impossible. Mm, I'm not sure if I want to put it in impossible or hard. I kind of want to put it in impossible. Because also you have to go fishing in the desert and who wants to go fishing in the desert? That sounds like really out of your way and annoying. It's one of the most annoying fish in the game to catch for sure. This is a sea cucumber. Sea cucumbers are annoying to catch. They're a little bit harder probably than a puffer fish, I would say. And while I'm at it, I'm just gonna do the super cucumber, which I think is hard. It's like a, just a little bit harder version of the sea cucumber. Shad is very easy. Now the slime jack is annoying to catch for a reason that's like different than a lot of the other reasons that fish are annoying to catch. And so you have to go to the mutant bug layer to catch it. And the mutant bug layer just has like all those stupid enemies that I hate from level 20 of the mines, those stupid burrowing things. I hate going to the mutant bug lair and as such the slime jack is so annoying to catch like you just have to fight off all these baddies the whole time which makes it just so freaking annoying i want to put it at like the top of annoying the bottom of hard but i'm not sure i'll put it at the top of annoying all right smallmouth bass might be the easiest fish in the game food fish is annoying probably just as annoying as midnight squid i don't remember having any particular issues finding this thing i'm already at the night market i might as well just pick it up now this squid i remember for some reason i remember this thing being annoying probably like above the glacier fish maybe above the midnight carp as well this thing was pretty annoying to catch yeah but it's in winter so that gives it the, like a little benefit all right Stingray is annoying. Stingray is a little annoying, but once you get to Ginger Island, you should have like a pretty big fishing skill. So it's not particularly hard, though it can be hard to like fish one up. I remember I had to fish up a bunch of them because I was trying to get a, uh, a fish pond with them so they'd produce cinder shards. Honestly, it might be in hard. I'll put out hard. I remember having a little bit of issue with the stingray. Stonefish is like the most annoying fish in the game because I always forget about it. I always forget about this stupid thing. I never remember it's even a fish and it looks so dang goofy. Look at this thing. Does it not look so stinking goofy? I always forget about it even existing. Now, this might be my most controversial opinion on the entire list. I do not think catching the sturgeon is that hard. I really find the sturgeon like not all that difficult at all. And I don't really know how it got this reputation of being like so insanely hard. I don't, I guess because it's available, it's needed for the community center. But like, I feel like so many people rank the sturgeon as like probably one of the hardest fishes in the game. And I'm like, it's like annoying to catch at the most. Sunfish is the easiest fish to catch in the game. It's literally your first fish that you're required to catch. Iger trout, it's like between easy and annoying for me. I feel like the annoying and easy tiers are like so filled out that I should honestly maybe like create a tier in between the two. All right, tilapia is easy. Tuna is annoying. Can be annoying to hook tunas too. 
Um, the walleye is, is annoying. The wood skip is annoying as well. Yeah, I definitely should add a lower tier. Okay. I'm just gonna call it okay. So now in this okay slash average tier, I feel like I'm gonna put the lingcod in there. I'll put the walleye in there, the tuna in there, this, sandfish, rainbow trout, albacore. Wood skip is okay. Wood skip is pretty easy to fish up. The annoying part is just like cutting down the tree to get there. The wood skip honestly also is my, one of my favorite fish because he looks like he's really mad. You know what I mean? You guys see what I'm saying? He looks like he's like angry. He's like... All right, void salmon is definitely uh hard or annoying you have to catch it in the uh is this also in the mutant bug layer no it's in the witch's swamp that's what i'm thinking that's why i'm mixing it up but there's not many things to catch in there but i remember it being not too hard i want to just put it in an annoying i don't remember the void salmon really being that all that difficult all right i think that's the final list but we can all agree on one thing at least i know that there's going to be a lot of differing opinions you know some people are going to say i place some things too high I'm going- some people are gonna say I place things too low. Everybody can agree that we hate the lava eel. The lava eel is the worst. I never want to catch another lava eel again. It's so painfully bad.